What is up you guys? Welcome back to another video. We are here in the beautiful Grand Californian Hotel. We're just gonna have a great time today. We're gonna be, you know, eating some food, checking out downtown Disney, going um, resort hopping to all the other resorts, and we're gonna check out all the holiday decorations. So join us along for a great time. So that was really nice and one of the other special things that they have here during the holidays is that they make in a huge gingerbread house and oh my gosh it's so big and it's so colorful. I love all the decorations. Um, we have Chip and Dale here as well as a Mickey Mouse a snowman which is super nice. Oh my gosh I love it and I believe there are also hidden Mickeys on uh, the gingerbread house so we're gonna try and find a couple for you guys. Over here on the side of the gingerbread house, they have all the information and it tells you how much ingredients they used to actually make this. 600 pounds of powdered sugar. Oh my gosh, that is a lot. All right, you guys, I'm going to show you a little hidden Mickey. That is right over there. You see that one? And then another hidden Mickey that there is on the tree. It's right there, see? Like I said, there are tons of Hidden Mickeys. There's 25 in um, this gingerbread house itself. But um, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to show you guys at least one Hidden Mickey per video. Let me know what you, how you guys like it, you know. Uh, I've shown you some, some of the ones in Fantasyland. I'm showing you some of the ones here in um, the Grand Californian. So it's pretty nice and you know, I just like to add them. I like to share my knowledge with you guys. It does look like they're setting up for the carolers that they have here during the holidays. So we are going to watch a little bit of that. So here's that. We're going to meet Santa right now as they have him here in the lobby. So we are going to go and, you know, meet Santa right now. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! How I'm, are you? I, I shall you guess day. your name and very good it is. Yes? Yes, let me look at you. Your name is Spaghetti. Your name is Meatloaf. And Sandwich. Chocolate of Tingo Heimlich. La 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 la! Would you like this year? I think I want an, uh, a GoPro. A GoPro! GoPro. Yes! Yes, that's nice. You put it on the, the surfboards and the thingies and you go, woo! Yes, so yes. There. I have literally built up my appetite the entire day um, to have dinner today because we're having dinner at a very special spot and it's Black Tap. You know, I've never had Black, ta black Tap, but you know, they go crazy for their meals. We're going to go try some Black Tap. Let's go. Look, I just got mine, but look at Kyle's. Holy oh crap. Oh We're gonna lunch tonight, cheat day. The size of this burger is like so huge. Mm. One of my recommendations, if you guys get the um, Wagyu Steakhouse burger, order a size of the Texan barbecue with it. This Korean sauce is so good. Like, I don't, I like, I'm liking more the um, Texan barbecue sauce on the burger, really? but like, the, the Korean so sauce like on the side, it's like fire. Especially like with the sweet potatoes. So guys, definitely recommend the Korean sauce. Oh, oh my gosh, now now I'm like super full. Like we just left Black Tap and that was a good meal. But uh, we are on our way now to Paradise Pier where we are going to um, check out those holiday decorations as well as I think we're gonna watch the fireworks over there because there is a rooftop where 
they do have um, the audio playing, that the same audio that they have playing in the park. So we're gonna go check that out and we're gonna see what is up at the Paradise Pier Hotel. Before we go, this entire area is going to get destroyed um, starting in January. I don't know when in January this is gonna get destroyed, but say goodbye to all this because this is one of the last times we will ever get to see this. walking out of a downtown Disney, we see the Disney carriage going by. This is so cool. This is the first time I've like seen it in person. So we just walked in into the Paradise Pier and this is like completely different vibes than the Grand Californian. The Grand Californian was so busy and everything. And here's just nice and chill, you know? And we got these nice Christmas trees everywhere. They have these nice cute like wreaths here that are filled with like, you know, um, ocean-y stuff, you know, like they have a uh, starfish, they have an octopus, really nice, and then they have some seashells over there, really nice here at the um, Paradise Pier Hotel. Me and Kyle like one literally went up one flight of stairs, and we're, done. And we're huffing and puffing, jeez, dude, that's why you don't eat black. <laughs> Okay, something really cool about these elevators is that you click the level you want to go to and then it directs you to the elevator and then it automatically takes you up. Literally no buttons in here. Oh, wow. So we clicked the, the um, firework viewing button and we are going to go to that floor right now. I believe it is floor three. So that is where they have, uh, they play all the music that you hear in the parks. They're gonna play them here at the hotel. When you guys come out here to the viewing deck, go all the way to the right and in that back right corner, that is where the, you're going to find some seating there and they actually um, have like some nice seats and then they have some speakers where they're going to play the music. I don't know if you can see it, but that is the very tippity top of the Matterhorn. So the fireworks should be a little to the left. Watch, it's 9 o'clock and you can already hear the music. that blue light that is the castle and then the fireworks get launched way behind the castle just a little way to get entertainment outside of the parks but I think we're gonna make our way over to our final hotel um, the Disneyland Hotel and we're gonna check out um, their stuff they have they don't have that much stuff they just have like a tree but we're gonna show it to you guys so let's go we are going to transport to the Disneyland Hotel ready three two one <gasps> whoa whoa Kyle are you good bro that did you guys like that transition that was that smooth it apparently it wasn't smooth for Kyle cuz cuz Kyle's on the ground it actually hurt. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, teleportation is real, guys. Out of all the hotels, I feel like this one has the least amount of decorations. Um, but wow, I, I, this like mural that they have here, as soon as you walk in, is like super nice and it's, like super big. Look, and then when you guys uh, walk out here to like the um, drive slash pickup area, um, they have these nice little lights over here with these uh, fountains, and they have these lovely icicles um, hanging from the ceiling. So they have the, the tr these uh, small trees next to the gift shop and then they also have these trees over here by the lobby but that seems about it. Okay, so we just came into the bathroom inside uh, the Disneyland Resort. There's no one in here again but look at this lovely wallpaper. I absolutely love it. I think it represents like all the Fantasyland rides. Like yeah. you see we have here Peter Pan, Storybook, um, Matterhorn, Dumbo. 
um, Alice. So pretty nice here. They're they're, they're getting um, Mr. Toad's Wild Ride though. Um, they have it's a small world here, you know, but pretty nice. I like kind of like it. Now they also have another Santa meet and greet here from 11 to 4:30 p.m., which is really nice. They have one at each one of the hotels, but uh, this is the photo op at the Disneyland Resort. Nothing too big here. They just have these um, um, trees everywhere. But for the ratio of land that they have here compared to the decorations, um, it's all right, you know? Um, I feel like when you go to the Grand Californian, everything's so big and, and, you know, crazy. But, you know, here it's like, it's subtle. It's subtle decorations. We haven't gotten uh, too much information, you know, regarding like big stuff um, here at the Disneyland Resort. However, we did get an announcement um, from Disney not too long ago that there is going to be a new tower here at the Disneyland Hotel and it is actually going to be a DVC exclusive tower. So we may have to check that out um, once it does come out. I, I'm not sure when it, it, it is supposed to open, but um, I do know that there's a new tower coming in with the new expansion of Downtown Disney. Believe it or not, we're going for black tab round two, but um, <laughs> Kyle's gonna get a shake. Maybe I might get one, I don't know. I just, um, I'm still a little full, I don't know. And I also don't want my stomach to hurt, so. My, I, I don't know, I just have a really sensitive stomach, but we're gonna go order uh, black tab uh, round two. Can they just get one Brooklyn blackout? Oh, <laughs> Yeah, get ready. Guys, guys, <laughs> holy. Just, uh, Literally just ordered a crazy shake. He was like, no, I'm gonna order like a normal shake. I'm gonna try to take it light tonight. He ordered the uh, Brooklyn Blackout. Oh my gosh, and they're about to make it over here. So we're gonna show you some footage of how they make it. But geez, Kyle, like seriously, come on. Oh, look at that. That's for Kyle's shake. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, look. It's literally, dude, it is like diabetes in a shake. Ready? Oh my gosh. Four. Look it. Yep. Oh Jesus Christ. I'm yep. Diabetes oh the drizzle. Awesome. Thank you. Ready? I'm regretting Yo. Oh. <laughs> oh Kyle just got this for the looks but he's definitely gonna like destroy it. I can try. Dude, oh, do you want some whip? Do you want some milkshake with your whipped cream, bro? Yes, sir. <laughs> this is how much whipped cream there is, and then he finally made it to the shake. Right. Alrighty, guys. So that is a wrap for today's vlog. Uh, Kyle, definitely. Did you have a sugar rush after that milkshake? Yeah. That was insane. Yeah. I I tried a little bit of it um after he was done. He he. You got what? Maybe halfway through it. Yeah. Yeah. So I tried a little bit after, and it was actually really good. Um. Yeah. It's different, you know, you, you can't compare it to Ghirardelli, but I hope you guys had fun um, on our adventure today. We were just, you know, we just got to check out the hotels, got to eat, you know, uh, just walk around downtown Disney. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to tune in every Monday and Thursday, 12 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. And all, like always, always make a difference. That's a peace out for today. We're here in the Paradise Beer bathroom and um, Kyle's taking a song. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, I don't know if this can go online. The only reason why I just filmed that was because we are the only ones in the bathroom. Thank you.